One very popular supplement that I personally really use and believe in uh, are BCAs and more specifically the leucine. Uh, they are a supplement that were very popular a few years back. Their popularity kind of downscaled a bit because they're not sexy anymore. People want to learn about the newest, coolest supplements. And really, BCAs are not something you feel working. I mean, you don't feel energized. Uh, you don't really do a lot more volume with it. Uh, you don't feel anything special. But they are a very effective tool to add to your arsenal, especially during fat loss phases. Now, the BCAAs, especially the leucine component, is one of the amino acids, the leucine is, that has the greatest impact on activating mTOR. mTOR basically is the trigger that starts protein synthesis. When you activate mTOR, I'm starting protein synthesis or muscle building. When you're training, when I'm training with weights, I am activating Lucy, uh, mTOR. When I'm eating a significant amount of food, I'm also triggering mTOR. Now, leucine can increase your response to that stimulation. In other words, if I have leucine in my blood when I'm training, the response of the mTOR to the training is higher which makes the training more effective at triggering muscle growth. Also, if I have leucine or BCAs about 15 minutes prior to a meal, I'm also increasing the mTOR response to the meal, which makes that meal more anabolic, more likely to build muscle. It's not a huge difference. It's not like you're gonna gain 20 pounds in three months. Heck, even steroids won't do that. But it gives you just enough of an increase to make a significant difference over the long run, especially when you're dieting down. I'm dieting down, I have a caloric deficit. It's harder on a caloric deficit to trigger mTOR. So it's much harder to build muscle, much more likely to lose it eventually after several weeks of dieting. The leucine or BCAAs are especially effective at allowing you to build a little bit of muscle even on a caloric deficit. Having as little as 10 to 15 grams of BCAAs pre-training and 10 grams of BCAAs before, about 15 minutes before a meal will drastically or significantly at least increase your capacity to build muscle tissue. So it is definitely a supplement I would consider adding to, especially it's super cheap. Uh, if you go to the xpnworld.com website, BCAs are super cheap, they are the highest quality possible, and it's in Canadian dollars, so US guys save a lot of money.